tango or? But we took our tamarind chutney, spiced it up, and that's what gives it that like other flavor. So. Ooh. Okay. Mm. Some lemon juice. Mm. Oh yeah, this is good. This is tasty. This I love tamarind. Kind of this is kind of like a Mexican Indian twist right mm -hmm. now. Exactly. That's an Indian remix. Then we have the Indian remix on. on the bunk. On the and then side. what is it? So this is also another one of their specialties here. It's called a Frankie. Yeah, so that's a Frankie. That's based on a, a roll that we have in Bombay. And it's basically street food. This is a perfect late night snack. So after you leave the club or something, you can go to these late night spots and order Frankies. Is it like an Indian burrito? Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. So I love the difference the with this though is that it has the um, garlic and cheese bread. So it's a paranta, it's a soft Indian bread, but with garlic and cheese infu infused into it. Yum. And then we take the same this same chicken tikka, so pull it out of the tandoor and then we add that into mm, there with some yellow so rice good. and then a masala. Like guys, wanna come say hey on the camera? Yeah, sure. He has a camera face, you guys. Yes. Come on. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to Bombay Beach. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> of course, okay. You wanna try this little Frankie? So don't unwrap it 100% okay. because it's super heavy. Okay. So just a little bit at a time so you can take a bite. It's, it's a little hot, so be careful. This is pretty much like a whole meal inside of a wrap. Exactly. This it is really like everything is. you would get on the table inside of a wrap. So that's actually. This is too good for street food, super baby. Super convenient. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm scared. It's, it is hot. It's Cheers. hot. Give it a, maybe give that one a second and work, you can work on everything else. Yeah, okay. I'm going to give it a second because <laughs> it really does feel super hot. So I don't want to like, hurt myself. I'm not what afraid of it, baby. Thing? Okay, so. This is called Rami Badam. This is an Indian summer drink. It's technically a Punjabi summer drink. So it is powdered cashew and almond with the Brahmi herb. The Brahmi herb is an Ayurvedic herb. It has a lot of uh, oh my God. qualities. Oh, you would never think, you would never guess what this tastes like. Oh, this it's is fire. Fire. Why is it green? So that comes from the, the herb. The herb, the yeah, herb. Yeah, I guess it's that color. You guys. Oh, it's that's radioactive. I could chug this. It tastes right like so <laughs> yeah, you told me, but it's it's like something you've never tasted before, right? There's it's, nothing out there. I've like never that. tasted this before. I've never, never tasted, tasted this. It tastes like kind of perfumey. It exactly, does taste perfumey. Exactly, it's like very, very floral taste. and fragrant. Mm -hmm. I love that. This that's burrito good. is fire. Burrito? It's not a burrito. Oh, Frankie. 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 <laughs> it's yeah. good. Yeah, I wouldn't even. <laughs> He's watching us. And I just like the reaction. Mm. Mm. The double mm lets you know that it's like. That you like that mama when you're watching your presents for Christmas. <laughs> yeah. You like I, feel it? So, I feel so proud right now. So. Yeah. yeah, this is fire. I could definitely eat this when I'm drunk. Oh, I could for sure. Even in the club, I would, I would smash this. I would smash this. I would smash this right now. In a few minutes, watch. Everybody was um talking about in our last video. How you look like you were starving? Because <laughs> I was. They were like, "Do you feed shy?" She does actually. I actually, really do. But she's a bigger girl. <laughs> <laughs> she's like eight feet tall, guys. I'm um, five eleven, and you guys want to show it? I went to the doctor today for my committee. Oh. <laughs> she does not have her boyfriend is here. Yeah, I didn't have that. Uh, but no, I went for just like a health and wellness check, but like for um, she was a holistic doctor. A holistic doctor this time. Yeah, so I'm actually 5'11 and 150 pounds. Which she weighs less than me, and she's so much taller than me. It's crazy. But which is in my range of how much I'm supposed to weigh. Really? I used to be one, yeah, I used to be one, I used to be underweight. You know I'm technically in an obese range. I can see that. <laughs> well. <laughs> I don't think if anybody, if we joke with anybody else the way we joke on each other, it would be an issue. For sure. Well, not if we would not joke like that. That's kind of my problem. Because when I like meet people for the first time, I have like a really like aggressive like type of humor. And like I'm so used to doing that with my friends. Like, and then I meet new people and they're like, what? And I'm like, oh god, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I remember we went to a party. And somebody had said something about it, and I was like, babe, that's just not my job. But he was an old friend that you met a long time ago. I think he was gay. What did I say to him? He said something, he, was, he said something about, I thought you just didn't like me, because you were, you were cracking jokes or something like that too many. 
Maybe it was gay. Remember him? No, I don't remember. I mean, I was but this is not like the first time that I've heard that, so it's just funny. I try, I try to be nicer, but I mean, I'm not mean. It's just yeah. my humor. I'm actually really nice. Every time people meet me for the first time, they're like, I'm shocked at how nice you were. But if we get to crack jokes, yeah. 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 I'm gonna try this in this. If you wanna act funny, bitch, we can get hilarious. No, oh, you're gonna eat the whole thing? Huh? You're gonna eat the whole thing and not want anything else. Mm. Also, you guys, if you didn't watch our um, African food vlog, a lot of people were mad at us because we didn't specify where in Africa the food was from. I'm pretty sure it was from Nigeria. I don't know if it was from like, Ghana or something, but. Right, so you guys can't come here without at least trying a chicken tikka masala. I know it's like a, sometimes people say it's like a plate out dish to have, but try ours and then you'll know where we stand in terms of okay. flavor if you have it. Wait, so, oh, so this is tandoori. Food. Yeah, exactly. So okay. that's just chicken tikka, so that's the chicken breast. When we say chicken tikka masala, it's basically a variation on butter chicken, but it uses the chicken breast. Mm -hmm. So it's a little more creamy, but it's delicious. I love, I love chicken tikka masala. I love chicken tikka masala. That's my favorite go-to like Indian dish that I get every single time. I've accidentally gotten tandoori. It's super good, but I like like the creaminess of it. Yeah. Everything like that. It's two totally different ways of having it. Right? right. So this is great if you're all about gains and like you want to have something lean. Go for the chicken tikka, the right. tandoori version. It's super delicious and yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, so this one is unhealthy. No, no, that's good. It's just more. <laughs> The, the word is it's more rich, you know, because it has the cream and everything like that. But that's actually, maybe if you want, I don't want to say dirty games. This is more like keto. Games, this no is like keto. Games. Exactly. That's lean. That's just like lean. Mm -hmm. And then you have just super flavorful versus like a uh, boiled chicken breast, right? Mm -hmm. Imagine doing this instead. So. I love it. Thank and you. are so informative. Right. I love that. I love that. I need to get an Indian boyfriend. So, you know, if anybody. It's yeah. like I'm right here. Hit that like comment. <laughs> Like like the beach bay, mom bay, beach Comment bay. under below if you think oh, I need to be a boyfriend. For sure. Then you can find the bomb bay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm, actually, this is my favorite. Chicken tikka. It is. Garlic bread. I'm actually gonna I'm, I'm gonna do something that is not probably normal, but I'm gonna take the pani curry and I'm gonna put it in the chicken tikka. Or, yeah. Are you living on the wild side? She's living differently, guys. I just... It's clean. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Little gas. <laughs> <laughs> Little gas in you? Having a hiccup? Yeah, I think about when people hiccup, I'd be like, do you have to park? Have you ever hiccup in your No. Have you? Yes. Probably. <laughs> Please. So this is also another one of my favorite um, go-to. Every time I get Indian tikka or whatever, you gotta get the samosas. You have to get samosas. You can get vegetable samosas or uh, chicken samosas. I know that um, a lot of Indian people are actually vegetarian, so they have a lot of really good options for vegetarian dishes. And that's like a fun fact about that. We should try Ethiopian. I love Ethiopian and Indian kind of have similar styles. I mean, not really, but I think like it's so different. I don't know. I mean, I'm just so, like the spice yeah. level, the spices. Oh yeah. Yeah, Ethiopian food definitely has like a good spice to it. It's like herbal mm -hmm. remedy. I also love Ethiopian food. I used to I eat it when I was younger. My family be like ordering Ethiopian food in the Bay Area. We definitely order Ethiopian food quite a bit. So in Louisiana, I eat nothing but seafood. Literally, I didn't start eating like this until I got here and like wanted to try and look at Los Angeles and like try to right. shit. I think just like being from California, especially if you're from like somewhere like the Bay, like you get a lot of you know different races or whatnot. So you get to try different foods and experience different cultures, which that's one of the main reasons why I love being from the Bay. It's just because I've grown up trying so many new things and I'm never like super thrown off. I always pretty much have like an open mind about- To try. Yeah, to try new things. Except for earlier she sent me 
a freaking post talking about, oh yeah, let's go here next for our next video. What was in the freaking thing? It was like, and this is this is where I come in from Louisiana because I'm like, I'll eat goat's ass, whatever, you know, just whatever, deer, chicken, alligator, frog leg, and I've had it all. So I'm just like, hmm, whatever, I can try something different. It was like bizarre food and but, I've had chocolate covered cockroaches, I mean chocolate covered crickets. Oh. You should eat a cockroach. Mm -mm. I would never. When I tell you there's one, probably one food I really could never eat is bugs. Even though I hear that they taste nutty. You you eat at least seven bugs in your life. I thought it was 30. Spiders. 30, bitch, you open your mouth while you speak. She'd be like this. Do I? No. You know I snore really loud. Have you ever caught me snoring? I'm not gonna lie, you guys. Last time I slept over at Shy's house, which was like last week, she farted really loud. <laughs> you did. She was laying on her stomach and it was such a loud poop. <laughs> That's why you left. I'm not even lying. She left in the middle of the night. She was like, I gotta go to my own house. Yeah, I did have to go home though. I went to the bathroom. I couldn't sleep because Charlie kept rubbing, rubbing her butthole on my eye. <laughs> and I was scared I was gonna get pink eyes, so I had to do. Wow. I'm eating with my hands like it don't work. I don't know, like, do a lot of Indian like cultures eat with their hands? I know, like, some do. Like, I've seen TikToks of like Indian people like <laughs> eating with their hands. But it's crazy how. Good that is, right? I'm so interested. Get my lip. Mm. Shout out to Elevator Bay. She's trying to buy me some shoes right now. But apparently they don't have my size. You said ours. They don't have kids either. You're trying to get y'all to match. Right. Not trying to be twins. Not trying to be twins. Not thinking of you. He just FaceTimed me out of the blue and was like, do you like these? That's cute. He's super sweet. He sent me flowers. Sorry, it's, the, the kitchen is like closed, so. But he um, sent me flowers the other day. Shout out to Elevator Bay. He's a sweetheart. This is so, this is different. I've never tried this. It's, it's really good. It's very good. I think this on a summer day with some fire ice or like over shaved ice a would be ice super fire. And a purple flower on top. I mean, she always, she always want to work it on her dang drinks. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you know she's a bartender. Well, I'm actually getting kind of full. I'm full. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I did eat a little bit before I came. Because she was taking part of herself. My holistic doctor. Yeah, she was at her holistic doctor. But um, also, you guys, so I did notice on the last video, which I noticed every single video, that you guys talk about Shy. I know you guys love Shy. I love her too, just as much, probably more, definitely more. So she, she's actually about to um, upload her first video. And we've been trying to think what we want to do. So we think we came up with an idea. We're not going to tell you what it is, but we're going to let you guys see it. And she's going to upload her video right after this one is uploaded. Yeah. Make sure you go subscribe to her channel. We're gonna film it. She's going to San Diego tomorrow. She's gonna to come back. We're gonna film her video. I know she's been slacking on her YouTube. I tell her all the time. <laughs> she's terrible. She's lazy. She's disgusting. No, she's <laughs> but I'm really trying to like, I'm trying to help y'all out. Cause I know y'all want to see the girl on her own channel. I, I, I really did try in 2018. I did. Y'all seen from the driver's seat. That was almost five years ago. Girl. That was three years ago. I know. It has been a long time. It's just the consistency part of it. I'm sure your fans will say something about that. <laughs> I am not as consistent as I would like to be. But I, that's why we're doing this. You know, yeah. it's helping you. We've been I mean, making an effort. Mm -hmm. I'm making an effort and I'm trying to include her because and I really I appreciate want to you for even including me and incorporating me because you know, I love you. I can leave you in a tux. <laughs> <laughs> I love your fans too. Honestly, the people now. love you. They are aggressive. You guys can be a little aggressive. You should be nicer. But I'm here for it, and I appreciate it. I really do. And you, you know, I love us together. Yeah, let's not do all that. <laughs> She's just a little too affectionate for me at times. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm full. Cool. 
to take it to them. Yeah. Her boyfriend is actually here, guys. Hey. He's over there making beats or something. <laughs> Is, right? He has his freaking headphones on. And his computer. He looks like he's on Instagram right now. He likes bitches' pictures. Wow. That's a disrespect for me. He's not. He's actually going through a comment. He really is, though. Yo, psycho. That was. <laughs> She's a little crazy. He loves them good comments. He loves. I was standing behind him one time just to like, because he was waiting for me to go to the bathroom. And I, was, I was kind of with the other thing. Uh huh. So I'm behind him. He's like 300 comments in the. Uh, <laughs> Evan is a little crazy. He's a little crazy. He, he's definitely uh, one of those lurkers. He pays attention to everything. He's paying attention. Yeah. And I'm like, what you doing? <laughs> and I was there for about a good three minutes behind him, and he's still reading the comments. No, too much. I figured I would shave him post to what. We're going to actually close out right now, though, guys, because I think my camera is about to cut off. But. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please be sure to subscribe to this channel, like this video, comment below. Do you guys want to see us try Ethiopian food next time? And also, comment below, what do you think that Shy's first video on YouTube is going to be? Let us know, give us your guesses. Hi. We would love to know if you guys like, do you understand our humor? Do you have anything you want to say to the people? I mean, you have said Evan, uh -uh. come here. Mm -mm. Come be in there. <laughs> No, 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 no. We talk about you all the time. No, we don't. No, he's not coming. Come on. I'm nervous. Whatever. <laughs> Lame. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but, um, yeah, pretty much. Do you have anything you want to say? No, yeah. Thank you for um, being patient with me. Watching. Yeah, thank you for being patient Definitely with me. Definitely be patient. Because I know I've been saying it for a while, and this is going to be the one. So y'all just tune in. Follow me. Subscribe to her channel. Turn the bell notifications on so you can get the notification for when she first posts. You guys, you do not want to miss it. It's gonna be hilarious. And we're gonna we're gonna work on being consistent. Yes, to consistency. Where are you finished? All right. She's a little gay. <laughs> Bye, you guys. It's so. <laughs> <laughs> I tried this.